Hi, I'm Brad from Tension. I want to show you the difference in surface temperatures between shaded and unshaded playground equipment. As you can see, it's a bright sunny day and the ambient temperature is about 92 degrees. I'll be using this infrared thermometer to measure the surface temperatures of the unshaded playground equipment behind me. I'll take temperature readings in several different locations. Now that I have data from this unshaded playground equipment, I'm gonna change locations and see how shaded equipment does. We're now at our second location. Behind me is some playground equipment that's being shaded by a tension shade sail. As you can see, the ambient temperature is about 99 degrees, so slightly warmer than at our first location. Once again, I'll be using the digital infrared thermometer to measure the surface temperatures at several locations. There is one other thing I want to show you, and that's the difference in the temperature of the sand that's in the sun and the sand that's in the shade. As a reference, I'm going to walk to the street and take a temperature reading of the asphalt to compare that to the sand that's in the sun. I want to end this video by reviewing what I found today. The ambient temperature was between 92 and 99 degrees. The unshaded equipment was as hot as 135 degrees. The shaded equipment was as hot as 102 and a half degrees. That's a difference of 32 and a half degrees. The unshaded sand was as hot as 132 degrees. The shaded sand was 91. That's a difference of 41 degrees. The sand in the sun was actually hotter than the street, which came in at 130 degrees. Shade makes a huge difference when it comes to using playground equipment comfortably. If you're looking to beat the heat, now you know what a shade sale can do.